Welcome to Bookable. In this video, you will learn how easy it is to connect your existing website to a Bookable account to accept online reservations. If you have an existing rental store with another website provider other than Bookable, Bookable can be integrated in order to allow your customers to select their dates and times through the online date picker, browse through your products, your product collections, and all of their availability, click into the product they wish to add to their online shopping cart and proceed to place their order on your bookable online checkout. All your website orders will now go straight into your bookable account, appearing on the orders page and reserving your items automatically off your availability calendar in real time. All of the information the customer has entered on the online checkout and more will appear in this individual orders page and you can move the order status whenever you're ready. All of your availability settings, rental period settings, prices, stock items, and more will all now be managed in Bookable and update automatically on your website if you should ever decide to make changes. So let's get started. In your Bookable account, you can go into the online store tab from the left-hand side menu and you can click over to the Add Bookable to a Website section. If you have a website with WordPress, Shopify, or Squarespace, each of these pages will have their own video tutorials we have previously published. You can click into the page that applies to you, stop this video right now, and watch the individual tutorial relevant to you instead. That will teach you everything you need to know about installing Bookable on your particular provider. However, if you are with any other website host, click the other website link and under step one, add the JavaScript snippet, copy that code to your clipboard. In order for Bookable to be connected, you must paste this code into the header of your website. In another tab, have your website's editor page open. Find where you can edit the header HTML of each of your website pages, starting with the home page and paste your recently copied code. The bookable online shopping cart should appear on the bottom right-hand corner to confirm the installation of bookable on your website is complete. It will also replace your previous add to cart button from your original website provider. You can publish your changes and refresh your page in preview mode to see that the cart has been installed. You can repeat this process for each of the pages you wish the online shopping cart to appear on. Back in your bookable tab, scroll down to view step two to add elements to your website. On your website, you can let customers choose a pickup and return date for themselves through the bookable date picker. In this page in your bookable account, you can click to copy the code for the date picker. Once you've copied this code, back in your website editor tab, you can click directly on the page where you wish this date picker to be, like the home page, and add a block. This may say a section, a block, an element, depending on your website builder. Click to add a specific HTML block or code block. And you can paste your recently copied date picker HTML code into this section. You can proceed to click edit design, depending on your website provider. This may say edit section or edit element to change, for example, the size of the block, the border, the padding around it, the alignment and so forth. You can do this specifically for the code block itself, or you can do it for the new section that you have installed the code block in. This will completely depend on how the editor works for your specific rental website provider, so you can play around with the changes until you like how the date picker appears. Once you hit save or publish, and once you refresh your page in preview mode, the date picker should appear on this page. 
You can repeat this process for any of the web pages that you wish the online date picker to appear. The date picker will reflect the rental period settings and your operating hour settings that you've set up in your bookable backend. If you ever want to change these, click into the rental periods page from the bookable settings menu and set up how you wish your product rental periods, operating hours, last minute reservations and away mode to work. You can click the link in the description box below to learn more about setting up your rental period settings. If this is a new website and you haven't added products yet, you may wish to add a bookable product list. In your bookable tab, you can click to copy the code under list of products. In your website editor tab, click into the page you wish this catalog to appear on, such as your product page, and repeat the process of adding the code block into your page directly in the exact location you wish the product list to appear. Repeat the process of adding in the HTML code, making any changes to the design of this block, for example, the width, the height, and the padding around it. Click to publish or save the changes, refresh the page in preview mode, and you will see the bookable catalog has been installed. However, if you have different pages for different types of products, you can add products individually to your pages instead. Click into your inventory page, click into a product and click the online store panel. If you scroll down on this page, you'll see the option for a product card, which is a small preview of the product, which the customer can click to bring up a more detailed view in a additional pop-up or a product detail view, which is exactly what will appear on the product card pop-up, but embedded directly into the page. So the customer doesn't need to click on it. You can choose the element that suits your site best, such as a product card, and make sure to copy the HTML code. And then in your bookable page of choice, such as an individual collections page, for example, you can repeat the process of pasting the code directly in the section of your page you want this product to appear in. This is a great option if you have a limited amount of products, uh, for example, an inventory of under 20 products, and you'd like some certain products to be on certain pages. Now let's talk about the options that if you have already added products to your website with your own text, images and so forth. If you like how you have designed your products in your website already and don't want to replace this with a bookable product card, you can instead just add the bookable add to cart button under each product instead. This will embed the price, the quantity selector, the variation selector and more. This code can be found in the same place under each individual product in the online store panel under the add to cart button option. You can add this into your website in the same process of pasting the HTML code. Here, it's best to click into the text element of your page underneath the image. And here you can click to add a widget, which can also be described as just an additional block. Once you click the HTML option, you can input the add to cart button code hit save and once you refresh this on your page it will display the price of the product it'll also display the quantity selector a variation selector if you've set up different colors or sizes for the product and an option to add also the product availability pop-up calendar you can repeat this for all of your individual products you've already set up on your website and as you can see this flows into the design of your website a lot better if you already have an existing site set up. For this option, you need to remember to remove or turn off all the prices you've set up in your external website for your products. In the link in the description box below, you can click to find our Help Center article that provides other codes you can paste into your website pages to display a search bar, collections list, and more.
Now, your products will have their prices, availability, quantity, and more completely run by your Bookable account. Anytime you make changes to these in your Bookable inventory page, this will reflect instantly on your external website. Now let's place a test order. On your website's preview mode, you can go through the process of placing an order on your online store. You can start by selecting the rental periods through your online date picker. Then you can test the process of adding products to your shopping cart, either through the product catalog list, your individual product cards, or the add to cart button you've placed under your already created products. And then proceeding to place the order on the online checkout. No matter which website provider you connect your bookable account to, every order will now go through your bookable shopping cart, not your website provider's cart. In your bookable online shopping cart, you can connect payment providers such as Stripe and PayPal to collect credit card and other payments for your rental orders. You can click the link in the description box below to learn everything you need to know about collecting online payments. You can manage how this cart looks and add or remove the fields that appear here for your customers to fill out by going to the checkout page of your bookable settings. You can read our Help Center article linked below or watch the video tutorial for managing your online checkout in Bookable. For all other online store settings, you can hit the Preferences page. And here you can edit your product availability settings, website fab icon, the colors of your Add to Cart buttons, and more. Our tutorial for managing these settings is also linked in the description box below. Once a customer places an order on your online store, this should appear in your Bookable backend on your dashboard, orders page and order calendar page. Now, same as any other order, you can click into it and update the order status whenever you're ready from reserved to picked up. You can also scan the product barcodes or specify the product identifier of the stock item instead for the item going out and also move the status to returned whenever your order is finished. And you're all set. You have now learned how easy it is to connect your existing website to your Bookable account to take online orders through Bookable.